Say hello to the kind folks at home, Nippo. Nippo. Hey. There you are. Okay. That's our new Chihuahua, Nippo, which is short for Napoleon. I like Nippo a little more because who knows how many small dogs in the world go by the name of Napoleon. And I got this package from SRS Cinema, which is a independent, very independent uh, DVD distributor whose bread and butter is mostly independent horror movies and equally obscure horror titles, often of a, often of a very gory and terrifying nature. Not my cup of tea exactly, but more power to them considering the large amount of titles they have and how successful they've been. Recently, they've gotten into a genre that is definitely my particular bread and butter, and that is giant monster movies. And I just got this package today from SRS Cinema. Um, I hope I'm saying the name right. Uh, but first off, I made... I made the... Uh, okay, so... Where to go? I'm terrible at improv. I apologize, ladies and gentlemen. But I really wanted to make this short little video. Uh, it's not—it's kind of an unboxing video. But uh, anyways, uh, uh, the guy, one of the guys in charge of SRS Cinema, I believe, oh darn it. I'm not going to start this video a second time. So just bear with me. I want to get at least his first name because he's been exceptionally good. I think he's in charge of, of the actual shipping and mailing. Um, Ron, we'll just call the first name Ron. He's one of the guys in charge of this company, if not the guy in charge in the company. But he's been very good at keeping the email correspondence with me and letting me know when my uh, DVDs or Blu-rays, in this case, are coming in. I have that habit of um, constantly getting the two mixed up. Well, not really mixed up. I just, you know, call all forms of digital disc media just DVDs. But this came to me this afternoon by the mail. So this, uh, let's see what I got for ordering their first two, I, I assume their first two giant monster movies. There may have been some horror movies they've done in the past, like some of those like terrible shark-looking movies, deliberately terrible-looking shark movies. Um, very tongue-in-cheek, some of the titles they bring in. So let's see what we got here. Oh, nice. All right, Deadly Playthings. I'm guessing this is a sticker for an upcoming movie release of theirs. I think it's a sticker. Yeah, I think it is. That's neat. Alright. Huh. What we got here? The vomit bag you're ready... Uh, this vomit bag will ready you to endure Shark House. Possibly the most horrifying film ever made. Guaranteed to upset your stomach. Banned in many countries. Now, I don't know if that's true, but most likely it is kind of made up Bollywood. And if so, that's very clever, because that's very much like a lot of the grindhouse cinema advertisements of the old days. Like, don't go see this movie, or else you'll die a horrible death, and you won't get a refund. Only at Shark House! Alright, <laughs> one of those kind of films. Alright, um, I'm going to have to put down the camera for a little bit. Okay, hopefully there's not like a weird strobing effect going on. Oh, yeah, this is a better camera angle for now. I got these two posters, and most likely these are posters connected to the movies I ordered. Yes, indeed. Okay, we got Raiga, God of Monsters, which is actually the sequel. Ironically, not ironically, but just uh, coincidentally being shown as the first of the two posters I got here. So, with artwork from Matt Frank... Quite nice. That's another thing about this company. Even though their movies are exceptionally low budget, they find some really good artists and graphic designers to do the covers for the DVDs. So, which I guess is true to low budget cinema. Make the poster look better than the film itself. But with that says, I'm still looking very forward to seeing this movie. So, Raiga got the monsters. And, of course, oh, we got, I'm probably saying the names wrong, so forgive me. Rago, King of the Sea Monsters. So yeah, these are some really good posters. As you can see, though, they've been rolled up, so it's kind of hard to keep them straight. But I think I'll put these in frames or post them on my wall very soon. But I'm very happy I got these two really nice posters. All right, along with the Shark House vomit bag, <laughs> you will har 
are. You will vomit in the face of Shark House. Rated R. Or, you know, in the Grindhouse tradition, I should just say, <laughs> Rated X. It's the 70s, so go ahead and bring your kids nonetheless, because Grindhouse. Alright, now here's the cream of la resistance. I'm probably saying that wrong. Got my Japanese and my French wrong, but these are the two Blu-rays I ordered. Each of them roughly $25 each. And these are official American releases of the two Japanese monster movies of whom the posters are based on. But once again, the sequel comes before the original. Raiga and Rego. So this is the first movie. These were independent films. My, I will put a link to a very good review for both movies from my friend Kaiju Noir. But these are the official American uh, Blu-ray releases of these independently made Japanese giant monster movies. And although they still, they're still somewhat obscure compared to like the big boys like Godzilla and uh, yeah, King Kong. Still though, it's great that these are officially available in America now. I just found out this deal recently, however, probably about a month ago, if not a little over a month ago. And it's sad, too, because um, I was at a convention where they were selling uh, Gray Market, or, you know, in layman terms, bootleg copies of these movies. And a friend of mine got them, and I figured, oh, good for him. It's like, those are movies I'll watch when I go and dog sit their house uh, in about three months from now. But then I discovered this wonderful deal. Um... And uh, that's why. And that's another reason I'm making this. Um, I'm making this very, very haphazardly made unboxing video because I want people to know about this release. Because this is these Blu-rays, I believe, are only limited edition, meaning that they will eventually sell out when the numbers are uh, out. But yeah, these are the wonderful Blu-rays with these great covers. Now I don't know if there's bonus features. But let's see what they got here. Huh. Okay, this is the back. Okay, it's very simplistic, but it works very well. Uh, bonus features, trailers, probably for other movies I release, um, including Shark House. You won't believe they got away with a puppet that terrible looking. Shark House. What? I'm a ham. I got to, okay? Um, black and white monster movie version of the movie. Oh, SRS trailers. Okay, so the trailers are probably for the related monster movies. And the SRS trailers are for their other, more horror-related movies, like... Shark House! Prepare to vomit your eyes through your head in disbelief! Shark House! Coming soon to a grand house theater near you. Okay. That one's for you, Ron. If you want me to do, like, really bad narrations for future videos, me and my friend Brayton, who are amateur comedians, bordering on professional, will be happy to, happy to do something for you. Um... Okay, and this is the Blu-ray for Raiga, God and the Monsters. So, and let's see what kind of special features they got here. Ooh, making of Raiga, the, of the Raiga monster. It's a Japanese commercial, TV commercial. Oh, no, uh, making of Raiga, most likely a Japanese documentary. Uh, uh, TV commercial and trailer, Raigo trailer, meaning the trailer to the first movie that came before it. Yes, buddy, yes, I'm also excited, and your little chihuahua likes to howl all the time. Do you want? Do you want to? You want to howl for the camera? Ruin this wonderful unboxing video with your, huh? Yeah. Huh? You want to go see Shark House with me? I think there's a discount if I bring my son. I'll dress you up as a human. We'll go in together. Okay. Why do we? Why do they always come here? Why do they always leave wacky animals out of my house? We got five cats and two dogs. Yes. Oh, God. Okay. TV commercial, uh, trailer for this movie, Rago trailer, and SRS trailers. Oh! Uh, it is apparently region free, region zero. Um, not rated, although I believe these movies are more in the P PG type house or uh, TV PG. Um, and, uh, apparently these are closed captions, so they do come with their own subtitles, although they are Japanese movies, so I think that just, that comes as a given. But yes, this movie is 80 minutes from 2009. It's more of a comedy, although it's still a sequel to this more serious, um, World War, 
war drama slash giant monster movie. This is also 80 minutes, also from 2009. Huh, that's weird. I thought there was a... I may be mistaken, but I thought there was a very good uh, disconnect between the two years. Maybe a typo, but nothing major. I'm so happy to have these right now, though. I'm very excited. These are movies I thought would never be officially released in America, and to see these kind of beautiful, well-made Blu-rays, along with my own new barf bag, yeah, although I'm a very large gentleman, as you can see, so I'll probably, I'll probably have to ask for the jumbo size version when I go see Sure Cows, possibly the most horrifying film ever made that also comes with a free vomit bag. Yes, dog, I know how much you don't like Shark House, all right? Your criticisms are loud and well-known. But yes, I really wanted to share this with you. Uh, Ron of uh, SRS Entertainment has, again, he's been really cool, keep me updated about a lot of stuff, answered a lot of questions. And I've contacted several B-movie distributors, or I should say independent distributors or of cult movies on DVD, uh, titles, um, companies whose names are going to remain nameless. Um, but yeah, they were far less, um, patient and helpful in some of the inquiries I have about some upcoming giant monster-related entertainment, but Ron of SRS, uh, Cinema, he's been fantastic, and I've made this unboxing video for, uh, ba basically for his bemusement, or amusement, I should say. Uh, bemusement is when you're confused and slightly happy by it at the same time, or at least the best I can describe it. But yeah, this is what I got. Um, again, both Blu-rays were about $25 each. Uh, the shipping was more or less free, I think, although I think it uh, boosted up to a full 50 at the end. Um, but no, this worked out beautifully. So thank you very much. I'm going to watch these two movies and hopefully make a slightly more professional, way more professional video in the future about my thoughts about these two movies. But yeah, this is my first unboxing video and i really wanted to share the contents that came with it but yeah uh thank you very much everyone at srs uh cinema uh ron especially but everyone else included um no thanks to nippo who is not the best dog on the screen and uh yeah i am very excited about all this now if you excuse me i'm gonna try my shark house bar barf bag by watching the latest episode of the view see ya Okay, if I had editing equipment, that's where the uh, video would have ended.